two, three. Ah! 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 Baby! Is it a boy or a girl? Well, it won't be your baby for long. No! No! Hey! You can't take my baby! You can't take my baby! I'll take her and put her with the others. No! And now we have all four of them. Come on. No, no, you can't take my baby. <gasps> no. It looks like the candy man has put themselves in this birth to death of a hacker upgrade, which means they can come in and out whenever they want. Well, Rebecca, you need to go back into the birth to death upgrade so you can save RZ Twin. Yes, Maddie, and I will stay out here and pull you out to make sure that you're safe. Zampi, I'm sorry, I'm going to go into this birth to death hacker upgrade. Okay, and I'm gonna go get RZ Twin's body and bring it back here. Remember the clue, it says, in order to save one, one must die. That's right, somebody inside the program is evil. You have to figure out who it is. And with this upgrade, if you die in the program, you might die in real life. What? what? No, no, Maddie, you, you never told me that. that. No. Well, the code is broken, so I will try to fix it. I have to do this to save our Z twin, okay, Zam fam? So I'm about to go into this birth to death of a hacker program, but before I do, make sure you are subscribed and join the Team 20 Club. That means subscribe to all of these channels with notifications on. Comment below, birth to death of a hacker if you did that, and let's save our Z twin. Okay, I'm nervous, Maddie, I can't die in real life. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. You're in. Get down, get down, get down. Okay, she's in. I'm gonna go find RZ Twin's body while you guys look for her mind inside this program. Let's give this video 100,000 thumbs up for RZ Twin. Okay, yes, 100,000 thumbs up. Let's do it. Are you sure you can handle this, Maddie? Seriously, Daniel, I've got this. What are you guys doing here? They have the baby versions of us and we need to break them out of here. We have to steal baby us? Let me see if I can fix the code so that way no one dies in the program. What are they gonna do with them? They're trying to take us, I mean them, through birth to death because if they die in here, they might die in real life. Exactly. Oh. 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 It's a nursery. Is that where we, I mean, the babies are? There's a giant window right here. Let's sneak under it and see if we can see if the babies are there. Oh, watch out. Oh, look. The babies have different names. I saw one that said Maddie. Oh. Look, Rebecca, there you are. And Matt and Daniel, you guys are in the front. Get down there, get down. Okay, so if we have to rescue these babies, we need to wait for this minion to leave so we can get in. Let me check where he is. Oh. He's leaving, you guys. Now is our chance to sneak in and steal the baby versions of ourselves. Let's go. Do you think they're running tests on the babies here? I think they're just trying to take out all of the Game Master's spies. That's how they're gonna eliminate us. We cannot let that happen. Quickly, grab your babies because I don't know how soon that minion is coming back. It's all clear. It's okay. Wait, do you hear something? Shh. Oh. oh my gosh. Go! Oh. Go, 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 go! You guys, we did it. We rescued our babies. We got the babies. Let me pull Rebecca out. Rebecca? You guys, we just stole ourselves out of the program. Well, now that we have the baby versions of us, we need to figure out which one of us is evil. Unless someone else in the program is the evil one. Like the candy doctor. The Game Master tracked RZ Twin's body location and it's here in this room. If I go inside, she should be right in there. Hopefully there's no candy minions inside, but I have to rescue her. What are you doing? What are they doing to you? What's this? A case with a code? Okay, I gotta get you out of here before something comes back. A wheelchair! Okay, you guys, I'm gonna go back into this birth to death of a hacker. What's the next program, Maddie? It looks like you're going in with the mini versions of yourselves. What? <gasps> huh. Rebecca, what took you so long? Our mini knees are coming. Mini knees? <gasps> Look, they're here. What? It's the mini versions of us! Awesome. So if those are our mini means, that means that we have to prepare them for what's ahead. I mean, they have no idea they're gonna be part of the Game Master Network, right? Right, okay, we need to teach them the skills that we know, you know, hacking oh, and yeah. battle royale, fighting skills. Yes. Okay, well, you know what? Let's go over there, meet them, and then we can split up and teach our mini me. Hi, guys. Great to see you. You're so mini. Hold on, how do we know which one's which? <laughs> Sort of obvious. Pretty obvious. We thought that it would be really good if we taught you guys some very valuable skills that you might need when you get big, because right now you guys are minis, but trust me, these skills are gonna be really important. Like hacking, fighting skills. Maybe some gymnastics for battle royales. And research. All right, so why don't we all split up with our mini me and take them and practice skills that we think they might need. Let's, Let's do it! it! How's the code going? I haven't been able to fix it yet. Okay, Maddie, if you don't fix this, somebody inside of this birth to death program might actually die in real life. I know, Matt, I'm working. 
working on it. Just get good, come on. All right, mini me, are you ready to learn some gymnastics? Yes. So we obviously have to start with just a salute. Oh, wow, you're already so advanced. I'm gonna show you a handstand, and then you're gonna do it, okay? Ready? And like, you just stay up here, and then you talk to people like that. Now it's your turn. Oh, 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 to a backpack? Oh, yeah. Why don't we move on to a car wheel? Now I'm gonna reach my hands out, and then push, car wheel! Okay, this might be pretty advanced for you, so you know, just take it easy. You're the mini me, you're obviously not as good as me, but that's okay, one day you will be. That was pretty good. There are a lot of things that you need to know. First off, nunchucks. These are now yours. You ever used one of those before? No. Here, let's look at it. Keep the spin. Oh yeah. And then you do. Pop it up here, connect it around the back. Ah. Okay, Maddie, so an important skill that you're gonna need is to know how to study, and this is a book that you are going to love when you're older. Do you know how to read? <gasps> you do know how to read? Okay, can you read this sentence? <gasps> Game Master. We should practice some battle royale skills. We're gonna get a lunch. Now, just pretend there's someone in a mask coming at you, and you're just gonna... <laughs> The most important thing you need to know is how to hack. Look at our heads. They say hack in, right? I'm gonna teach you how to hack in to Maddie's computer and we're gonna access her camera roll. Start, just, yeah. There's a firewall here, we're gonna break it down. You ready? Press that button. Got it, you've accessed it. Okay, now scroll over. I got goosebumps. Wait, I got goosebumps. That's weird, but we're in a program. Did you just see a candy minion behind Daniel and Mini Daniel? No, I didn't see anything, Maddie. Okay, Zam fam, I swear that I saw a candy minion. Go back and watch. Did you see a candy minion too? I think you're seeing things, Maddie. Just work on the code, okay? Come on! High stakes here! I know! These are gonna protect you one day in a battle royale. Learn how to use this. Watch as many Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle movies as possible because it's gonna teach you all the skills. Karate! Karate! Ninja moves! Ninja moves. You like Brown Red? She's kind of annoying. <laughs> You have to learn to keep those thoughts to yourself a little bit. This is gonna get you in trouble if you talk like that in the future. I'm just telling you from experience. Can I tell you something that I'll do when I get older? Yeah, oh, it's a secret. Now this is what I like to call the crazy face. This always scares people. <laughs> That's really good. Okay, now we're gonna kick. You're gonna go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, she just did a jump. <laughs> I think you got it. You're pretty advanced, you know? One day, you're gonna have to use those skills. All right, minis, did you guys enjoy your training? Yes. Good, because one day all of those skills that you learned will become very useful. Where'd your big go? She always does that. You guys, we have mini me's. Did you see that? Rebecca, you kind of focused a little bit too much on the skills. We need to figure out who the evil person is. I know, but like they're little. How are any of them gonna be evil? Any of us? The further we go on, the more dangerous it's gonna get. Okay, hey, Maddie, have you figured out the birth to death program so we don't actually die in real life? Not yet. There's still a chance that you could die in real life. Let's get you out of here. Okay. Someone's coming. Oh, no. I gotta hide. Oh no, I have to pretend to be a body? Okay, here we go. Okay. Good. Okay, okay. We've gotta take our chance, you guys. We have to get RZ Twins mind so when Daniel comes back with her body, we can bring her back to life. You don't have to do this right now. Are you kidding? It can't be that bad, Maddie. What am I doing next? It looks like you're going in with teenagers. Make sure you keep an eye out for who is sus. Okay. Teenagers, really? Can we like skip this phase? This is the most awkward part. We can't skip it, Matt. This could be the moment when she finds out who is evil. Okay, okay, just work on the code, Natty. You guys, what's wrong? We don't know what to do with them now. They're teenagers now. Are you kidding me? I'm so excited. What are we doing today? Oh, yes, just got through the firewall. Okay, they're teenagers, which means it's getting more dangerous here in the program. But anyways, we need to teach them how to protect themselves if someone breaks into their home, like Home Alone pranks, you guys. That's Why good. don't we yeah. teach them Home Alone pranks, That's okay? Fun, yes. Home Alone pranks, this is gonna be so much fun. No, this is gonna be the best. I can't believe we're doing this. Yes! You know what, after we teach them the pranks, we'll do a real life version, Matt. You can pretend to be the robber breaking in, oh. and we'll put their skills to the Test. Yes. So let's all meet up with our teenage versions and teach them how to do these Home Alone pranks. Yes. Daniel, Daniel. Yeah. how do we tell which one's which? It's pretty obvious. Well, hello, teenagers. Guys, come on. Yeah. No, Minnie Matt, huh? I said it was obvious. 
Ah, blue shirt. Sorry about that. Well, now that you guys are teenagers, we thought that it would be important that you learn how to defend your house in case a robber breaks in. So us, the experts, are going to teach you guys some home alone pranks. Teenage Rebecca, why don't you come with me? All right, yo. Look, you got through that firewall? Oh, yeah. Oh, man. Okay, come on. All right, Minnie Matt, let's do this. Are you kidding me? Get your butt over here. Come on. We can probably figure out who the sus one is. Okay, Zam Zam, keep an eye out for who the evil person is. All right, Minnie Matt, we are the first line of defense right now. We are setting up a tripwire. It's an invisible wire that's going to be connected to a little explosive that might surprise somebody when they walk in. I don't think it's going to work. Well, you're not old enough to make those decisions, okay? So just go with this. So why don't you take this to the other side, tape it up over there. Tape it tight! It's in. Now, I need you to set this up right here and just connect it in the back. And I trust you, I need to go uh, run an errand. Yeah. Okay, finish it up. Okay, Teenage Maddie, this Home Alone prank is the best. It is Legos on the floor. We are gonna spread these all over the floor, so if a robber came in, they would have to walk through them. I mean, have you ever walked through Legos before? It hurts so much. Right, okay, so this is the best prank ever. Just go ahead and spread them all out. There we go. Oh, this is gonna hurt. One of my iconic things that I have done in Home Alone is tie up pillows like this, okay? So we're gonna tie it up and then we are gonna throw it over this. And we're gonna be able to knock out anyone that tries to break into the house, okay? All right, do you wanna try throwing it over? Yes. Okay, this is a tester. Oh! Okay, we gotta lower it just a little bit more because we gotta make sure it hits them in the face when they are least expecting it. All right, this is set up. I bet the girls need some help. Why is teenage Matt going to help the girls? They don't need help. Did you see the girls? They obviously need help, Maddie, okay? That's not sus at all. Come on, we're almost there. These are really light. Why do you need my help? Note to my younger self, start working out now. Three, two, one. Oh! We're gonna hang out right here, and when the robber comes up the stairs, we're just gonna toss him down. They're gonna trip all over! Yeah! You think it's gonna work? Of course. Okay. Well, what if a robot comes? <sighs> robots are tricky. They could be evil, or they could be ones that you fall in love with, so just be careful around robots, okay? <sighs> oh. Beanie go. Where'd my beanie go? Okay, teenage Rebecca, so everything is all set up. We are ready to go. We're gonna be able to throw it hey, over. You guys are doing it wrong. What? The knot? What? Yeah. Yeah, he's right. I guess we could do it a little bit tighter. Okay. There. I fixed it. Thanks, teenage Matt. Hey, do we have a little bit of time? Yeah, I think so. I just have to use the bathroom. Oh, okay. <sighs> these all look good. All right, well, are you guys liking these Home Alone pranks? Yeah. Pretty good, right? Who's that? Oh, no. Oh, no, there's a robber trying to break in. I thought this was just practice. Get back, get back, it's real life now. Hey, teenage Daniel, come on, there's a robber coming. I gotta get ready. Oh no. Get in your position. We have to defend the house. This is home alone in real life. We got this. Mysterious robber here, steal $10,000. Anyone here? If you are, you're probably home alone. <laughs> nice disguise, Matt. You really look like a home alone robber. Hold on, I actually look pretty good, Maddie. In what world? Birth to death of a hacker, obviously. No shoes allowed. I have to lose my shoes. I'll be honest, it is a lot more comfortable without shoes on. That's a great sign. Let's go rob something. <laughs> Who does Legos on the floor? That's totally inconsiderate. Matt, remember that time that you had to walk in high heels so that you didn't have to walk on Legos? Maddie, we said that we could never talk about that again. Why are you bringing this up right now? Especially, this is a bad time. Just focus on the code. Hello. You know what? I bet all the money's upstairs. No more Legos upstairs. Okay, teenager Rebecca, now is your chance. Throw it and hit him in the face. Coming upstairs. Haha. <laughs> what? What was that? Oh no! Someone cut the rope! That must have been a teenage Matt. Good thing we have two pillows. Someone cut one of the ropes. I wonder who is up there helping the girls with the pillows. Okay, teenager Matt is not evil, Maddie. It was obviously Daniel. Look at his face. Three, two, one. So he just drops a pillow? That's a new one. Never even seen that before. Ooh. Oh! Okay, that got me. Woohoo! We got this. No more Mr. Nice Robber. <sighs> now he's coming up the stairs. Hopefully Daniel and Teenage Daniel are ready. Nothing's gonna stop me! Oh, here he comes. You know what to do. Oh yeah, I do. Let's do it! Yeah! Now it's time for the grand finale. What's that? You'll find out. Come on. Oh, yeah. oh my gosh. What's next? Oh, no. No. Ah! Oh! <laughs> 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 
They all got to pie you in the face. I wish I could do that right now. Why would you want to do that to me right now, Maddie? You should be focusing on this code. My wife could die right now. Just fix it, please. Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh, our teenage self did so good at these Home Alone pranks. Let me pull Rebecca out. <laughs> Where'd she go? Oh, Matt, you got a pie in the face. I didn't just get one, I got four. Right now, Matt, you're looking pretty sus. I mean, you might be the evil one. Did you see what happened to the rope and the pillow? Yeah, I don't know how that happened. And remember, the clue, in order to save one, one must die. So, Matt, if you're the evil one, that means you're the one we have to destroy. Wait, you guys gonna destroy me inside the program? Not for sure yet. Zamfam, comment below who you think is the evil one. I think it's too early. I mean, teenagers do crazy things, but that doesn't mean they're evil, so. I think I'm saving here. Yep, same stupid robot laying on her stupid slab. Something moved. Wait a second. That's a clock! Oh, no, oh, no. I hope he doesn't know that I'm here. Uh huh. Uh -huh. People are taking a mess. Gotta do everything myself nowadays. You stay here. <laughs> <laughs> We're trapped in here. I gotta get out. We gotta save our Z twin. Go on. Do it. Okay, Maddie, where am I going next? It looks like you're going into graduation. Graduation, which means they're getting older. And it's getting more dangerous. All right, well, hopefully we can figure out who the evil one is and take them out. We have to get our Z twin's mind. All right, Maddie, here you go. <sighs> Whoa. Hey guys. Mm -hmm. What's going on? What do you mean what's going on? We just graduated high school. <laughs> Cheers? Yes. Cheers. Cheers to graduating high school. Cheers to going to college, never talking about what we did last summer. What did we do last summer? We were making a pact because someone downloaded and hacked in and got the answer key for the SATs. What? Yeah, and they gave it to us. Yes. So we used it? Yeah. Yeah. But we're not telling anybody. Hey, well, who did it? No one knows. Yeah. We made a pact about cheating. Yeah, that's kind of sus, actually. We all cheated together. That makes all of us kind of evil. But we all got to go to the colleges we wanted to go to. Isn't that kind of like cheating? Not if no one finds out. Hey, wait. Don't say anything. You know what? I've had enough. Oh, you have a knife! Oh, my! No, 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 no. Put the knife down! It's time to have some cake. You just keep a knife with you at all times? Yeah, I'm serving cake today. You know what, Maddie? This is better. Ah! Whoa, whoa. Oh, gosh. Hey, Since when does Matt serve oh, cake? Cake aggression. Maybe don't use that anymore. Whoa. Okay. whoa. Drink that fast. Actually, I have to use the bathroom. I'll be back. Don't do anything crazy while I'm gone. <laughs> He's a little excited. Daddy, what are you doing on your phone? Texting a boy. Are you texting the candy minion? No, Matt, I am not the sus one. Being on your phone doesn't make you sus. Actually, Maddie, you don't know if you're the sus one or not. You could be texting the enemy. So, where are you guys going to college? Harvard, obviously, with those SAT scores. <laughs> <laughs> Candy Minion! You just left and now there's a Candy Minion? No, Maddie, you probably texted him to come. He's gonna get her. <laughs> Did you guys see what happened in there? At the beginning. Yes. Maddie texted that person to come over. You were the one who left right when the candy minion showed up. It was just bad time. Okay, just bad time. let him in. Listen, we need to figure out who the evil one is right now. Both of you guys are a little bit sus in this program. But Rebecca, it's getting more dangerous right there. The guy almost got you. Okay, I know, but we have no choice. If we haven't figured out who it is, we have to or we can't save RZ Twin. Be more careful this next time, okay? I the mean, consequences are huge. Hey, Maddie, just pull me out if you see anything dangerous like you just did. You got it. You okay, what, what's going What's back next? In. What is next, Maddie? Rebecca's getting married. <gasps> Rebecca, it's your wedding day. Here's your bouquet. I'm so excited to be your maid of honor. Oh, you're my maid of honor. The wedding is about to start. Okay, awesome. I'm getting married. Oh my gosh, we're getting married again. This is amazing. This was the best day of our lives. Matt. Rebecca. We're getting married again. No, we're getting married for the first time. Oh yeah, yeah, of course. Who's our officiant? Right here. Oh. Thank you. Daniel's the officiant at your wedding? Honestly, that's pretty cool, but finally you're not putting yourself in this wedding. I mean, I am the maid of honor. Yeah, but you're not getting married. That was super weird before. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, oh God. Thank you, Daniel. Excuse me, okay. I'm gonna officiate. Okay. We are gathered here today in the sight of everyone here to witness the union of Matt and Rebecca. I have known these two for many years. It is time that we make it official. Matt, do you take Rebecca to be your wife? I do. And Rebecca, do you take Matt to be your husband? I do. By the power vested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Ah! You may kiss the bride. 
Stop the wedding. That bride is under arrest. What? There's a cop at the wedding? What's going on? Stop the wedding. What? Stop the wedding. Stop the wedding. <laughs> we got an anonymous tip that she stole the SAT answer key. What? Oh, no, I did like, not. I did not. That. Rebecca's the one with the SAT answer key? Does that mean that Rebecca is the evil one? Yeah, she might be the evil one, but who called the cops? Wait a minute. What's what? that? Wow. That wasn't me. I didn't steal an SAT key. You're going to prison for a long it. time. This is a misunderstanding. Guys, now Rebecca is getting arrested and going to prison on her wedding day? This is bad, okay? So I didn't do this. I'm being go, framed. Go, go. She would no. never do She's this. Framed. Let me go. Stop. Let me pull her out. I didn't do it. What the? I didn't do it, you guys. I was framed. There's no way that I could have gotten an SAT answer key. Maddie, you handed me the flowers at the wedding. Maybe it was you in the program that did that to me to frame me, to set me up. I didn't do it. You were the one with the bouquet of flowers. It's your bouquet. Yeah, but you guys, I I'm not the evil one. If I am, that would mean I have to destroy myself. It's not safe for you to destroy yourself, Rebecca. You know that. Maddie, uh, have you fixed the coding? I haven't found out a way to get around it. I'm going to keep working, but you need to get back in there and deal with this. All right, I need to do this. I don't think it's me, you guys. I can't be the evil one. Interrogation time. <gasps> Just like I said, you'd end up in prison. I wasn't the one that stole the answer key to the SATs. Tell it to the judge. Sam fam, this is bad. Do you think that Rebecca actually did it and is the evil one? Okay, so she is handcuffed to a desk right now? Okay, well, you can't prove anything because I didn't do anything. Tell me about the SAT answer key. Well, I know that it was in the roses when I was getting married, but I didn't put them there. I was set up. Well, your friends had something different to say. Maddie, which one of us do you think told the cop? It was probably you, Matt. No, Maddie, you're super sus. You probably texted him like you did at graduation. Look at this. I was shocked when you came in at the wedding. I had no idea. Daniel? No, I didn't see it in the flowers earlier. I guess she was acting weird, but I thought it was just because it was her wedding day. Maddie? Yeah, it was her idea for us to use the answer key, but that doesn't mean she's the one who did it. Nope, my wife does not keep secrets from me. Okay, but maybe she's kept a couple. Matt? Okay, so if my wife wife is a convicted felon, does that make me convicted as well? If we both go to prison, are we in the same cell? Well, this doesn't prove anything. None of them said I did it. Actually, one of them did. Who? Who was it? You'll have to ask the judge that. Let's go. You're going to prison. No, I didn't do anything. Yeah. He's taking her to prison. This is bad. Rebecca could be the evil one. Let me go. And don't think that you're getting RZ Twins mind from the dead nation room. <laughs> what? I didn't do anything. Come on! That's the detonation room that the cop was talking about. That must be where RZ Twin's mind is, but if Rebecca's getting locked in jail, she can't save RZ Twin. Oh, I said I didn't do it! Enjoy prison. Hey! Let me out of prison! I didn't do it! I'm pulling Rebecca out of prison now. <gasps> you guys, I'm in prison! I'm the one who did it! I mean, even one of you guys said that I was the one that stole the answer key. That's what the cop said. No, it can't be true. It can't be true. No, that, that means that, that I am the evil one. You guys, the detonation room, that's where RZ Twin's mind is. If I can just figure out a way to get in there. Rebecca, you can't go in the detonation room. You could die. Yeah, it's too dangerous. You cannot do it, Maddie. Is the code fixed yet? No, the code is not fixed, so you might actually die in real life, Rebecca. You guys, if I'm the evil one, that's the only way this program will work and we can save RZ Twin's mind. Are you saying it's either you or RZ Twin? Are you kidding me right no, now? No, it's me to save RZ Twin, you guys. Just put me back in. I have to do what I have to do. This is a bad idea, Rebecca. This is terrible. This is put terrible. me in, Maddie. Okay. We cannot let Rebecca die right now. You know, I'm gonna try to fix the code so she won't die in real life. Do you think she's the evil one inside this program? The only thing evil here is us. What? Hey, hey, we're gonna come. Hey, 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 Okay, so I am back in prison. I need to figure out a way to break out so I can get to the detonation room and get RZ Twin's mind. Except if I go in the detonation room, this might be the end. It's okay though. No, 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 no. What's going on? Guys? Get in there according to your hike. Let's go. Guys? Ah. Guys? What are you doing? Hey, what are you guys strapping us up to? What does it look like? Look at your chest. <laughs> oh, by the way, you can drop the keys. It's not like they've got time to get it. Now it's time to go get Rebecca trapped in the program. Enjoy your stay! Wait, we are trapped in here. We have to get the keys to escape. I know we need to save Rebecca. They can't trap her in the program. Look, there's keys to the yeah. handcuffs. Okay, you just need to reach them. You know what? I think if I knock myself down, I can get free. Okay, I'm gonna move my chair towards you to help. Here we go, here we go. I'm going down, I'm going down. Oh, oh, oh! oh. We did it! Sam, Sam, I do not recommend doing that. Okay, I'm free. Where's your twin? Where's your twin? 
Oh no. I've been working out a little bit. Let me get you out of here. Three, two, one. Ah, here we go. Okay, let's get out of here. That was easier than taking candy from a baby. No one's going anywhere. Well, there's two of us and only one of you. This will be easy. Now get out of here. There's more where that came from. We know what you know. She'll be back for you. What are you guys doing here? Great, now we're in here with the evil one. Me? I'm not the evil one. I'm not the one that stole the key for the SATs. I mean, Maddie, you handed me the bouquet at my wedding. You must have been the one that did it. I didn't do it. Who was the one at graduation who went to the bathroom to let a minion in? Oh yeah, Maddie, well you were on your phone the whole time. You probably texted them to come. I didn't text them to no, come. Okay. You're the one who listen, listen you guys, contract. listen. We need to focus so we can get RZ Twin's mind out of the detonation room. Wait, wait, what did you just say? I said, when I was being brought to jail from the officer, he said that RZ Twin's mind is in the the detonation room, so we can just break out of here and get it, and we... What? What's so funny? What? Thank you, thank you, Rebecca. That was what I needed to hear. <laughs> oh, come on, Matt, we need to escape and save Rebecca. Yeah, I got free. Now, I'm just gonna get the key with my foot. I got it, I got it, hurry up. Maddie, how close is the key to the hole? Move the key a little to the right. Okay. Okay, and up to the right a little more. There, there, you got it, you got it. Oh. Here we go, three, two, one, I got it. I think we just need to be super careful right now not to break any of these wires right now. If we break one of the wires, we're gonna explode. They're gonna trap Rebecca in the program and then we can't get RZ Twins' mind back. Calm down, calm down. Just be careful. Okay. We can't let this thing explode. Let me get you the other side. How much time do you think we have until this explodes? I didn't see how much time was on there in the first place. So hang on, here we go. Almost there. They must have your mind by now. We're gonna bring you back, RZ Twin. Guys, Rebecca's by herself? Matt, Maddie, where'd you guys go? She's in the program by herself? Oh no, okay, hold on. Uh Okay, I gotta go check on Rebecca. Okay, now that we're free right now, how do we deactivate this device? I don't know which wire to cut. <gasps> Red, white, blue, left, yellow, yellow, green. Fro! How do we know you're not just gonna blow us up? You're gonna blow up in 30 seconds anyway. Do you want me to help you or not? Do it, Frog. Red, white. Let's get out of here. Come on. You gotta say Maddie too. Really, Matt? Uh, yeah. Great. Okay, I have to go. Surprise, surprise, you're just leaving again. I only came so that way you could save Rebecca. Save Rebecca, not Earthy Twin? Come on, man. Get out of here, okay? Come on, hopefully. They did not trap her in the program. We have to stop that. Careful, careful, careful. They're deactivated. Zim, is Rebecca okay? What is going on right now? Get out of this thing. Super careful, Maddie. Let's get back to the tiny house to save Rebecca. Let's go, come on. Evil Daniel? Yep, I've been evil from the start. During Home Alone when we were teenagers, I'm the one that cut the rope on the pillow and framed it on Matt. That was you? And then during graduation, when Maddie was on her phone and Matt left to the bathroom, they both looked sus. That was a perfect opportunity to take out this remote and call a candy minion in. So you framed Maddie and Matt? And during their wedding, when Maddie handed you the bouquet, that was the perfect opportunity for me to slip in the USB drive with the SAT answer key on it. Well, when did you do it? When I hugged you. How did the cops find out? Oh, when I was officiating your wedding, that was me giving the cops an anonymous tip telling them that you had the USB drive. And finally, in the interrogation room, I was the one that told them it was you. So when they take you to the detonation room, you'll all be gone, along with RZ Twins mine forever. No! Where did they go? Oh no, oh no, 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 no. That's the evil Daniel in there. What's he doing inside the program? Sam fam, where are Matt and Maddie? They're supposed to be here watching Rebecca in case she needs to come out. I think I'm gonna have to go into the program. This is not permitted to have more than one person, I don't think, but I have to try it. I need to save my friends. Oh yes, a second hand piece already. Yeah, here it is. <sighs> evil Daniel, you can't leave us here. No, no, hey! Evil Daniel, you're not gonna get away with this. Let us out. Now to find this detonation room. Did you know that Daniel was the evil one this whole time? I mean, I almost sacrificed myself because I thought I was the evil one. You know what? Listen, there's still hope. Did you hear what he said? He said he has to go find the detonation room and he left the wrong way. I know where the detonation room, I walked by it, right, Sam Fam? Which means we can break out of this prison, we can try to get there before he finds it and save RZ Twin's memory. So let's just try to get out of here. I have to go in there for you, Rebecca. Let's see if I can configure this. Okay, set for me to go in. All right, this is gonna be very dangerous and I hope that Matt or Maddie can come out and pull us out once I'm in there. But I gotta go in, I gotta save my friends. Three, two, one. You guys look for any way to escape here. Oh, oh, Daniel! Oh, it's you guys, a, what are you doing here? Oh my gosh, what are you doing in the program? Two, one. Oh, Daniel, you did it! 
Yeah. Evil Daniel's in the program. I know. That's what I saw. That's why I came into the program, even though this is really dangerous. Evil Daniel went that way. The detonation room is that way, and that's where RZ Twin's mind is. We gotta save RZ Twin. We have to get there before he does. Go, go guys. Go, go. What is Daniel doing here? RZ Twin's body. He must have got her body. So now there's two people in the program. <gasps> the room. It's up here on the left. <laughs> oh no, there's Evil Daniel. No. Oh, he's gonna get to the room before us. Is that Evil Daniel? No. Oh no, this is really bad. Maddie, can you work this? I'll try. I'll try, but. <laughs> Daniel. Hey. Oh. Oh. Just hold the door open. I'll be back. Oh. What's going on? I don't know. <laughs> evil Daniel. We have to go in. We have to save him. He's in. Oh. He's in. Here, take it. What? <laughs> We did it! We have RZ Twin's mind! No, no, no. Remember the clue. In order to save one, one must die. No. I have to detonate myself. No! Ew, I gotta be no, in here. Daniel! Talk to me. Why not? You can't to come back! Me! No! No! Daniel! No! Daniel! Daniel! Oh. No! No! Did Daniel just die? If Daniel's dead, I don't know if I can pull him out of this program. He might be dead in real life. Daniel! <gasps> Daniel! to the Game Master, and I'll be in touch. <laughs>